Fast Start is a collaboration between Syngenta and, and Cottonseed distributors, bringing together world-leading genetics, chemistry and technology. Each year, the Fast Start program funds a number of projects, all aimed at improving crop establishment and the ultimate yield potential. We're going to have a look at a couple of those projects. Firstly, the Soil Conditions Project, managed by Michael Braunack from CSIRO, and also the Cotton Discovery Project, managed by the Cottonseed Distributors Extension Team. So firstly, let's have a chat with Michael Braunack on, on his project. Hi Michael, can you tell us a little bit about the project you're managing? Thanks Ken. Well, I'm working on this um, cotton seedbed project funded by Fasto. Um, basically what we're trying to do in this project is to look at quantifying seedbed conditions that enhance crop establishment. Crop establishment can be compromised by poor seedbed conditions, resulting in uh, poor establishment and the necessity to replant. So basically if we can quantify a seedbed condition to provide an optimal establishment, we can minimise or eliminate replant. But the problem is it's a range of soils that we're working on, different conditions. It's a whole suite of factors that can affect crop establishment. Not only seedbed conditions, insects, nutrition, compaction at planting, subsequent uh, climatic conditions, lots of rain, no rain, all these things impact on seedbed and crop establishment. If we don't get it right in the first instance, we're missing out on potential. Michael, there's obviously a lot of factors affecting uh, an optimum seedbed. What do you consider that is the most critical for growers to, to be aware of? I think the most critical thing in the first instance is being aware of what your soil moisture is at the time of planting. If it's too wet, you'll just smear the soil, create compaction problems and end up with poor establishment. If it's too dry, you'll end up with a clotty seedbed with the same result. There's a sweet spot. And it's probably determined by something growers know about but have um, forgotten from the past. And that's a simple ball test. Take a lump of soil, roll it into a ball. If you can't roll it into a ball, it's too dry. If you can roll it into a ball, it's too wet. If the ball crumbles as you attempt to roll it, you're pretty well spot on. And hopefully good seed bed conditions will result and fantastic establishment. Thanks Michael, appreciate your time today. So we'll just go and have a look at the uh, Cotton Seed Distributors Discovery Project. Hi Rob, do you want to give us a little bit of rundown on some of the programs you're looking after this year? Um, well Ken, we're here at uh, CSD Farms and we're actually looking at the Fast Start Discovery Program. And really that program is about uh, taking a whole range of compounds and different treatments that we can put on seed and assessing them in the field. So what are some of the examples of the work you're doing this year? Well, we're looking at a whole range of things and that includes uh, new fungicides, uh, treatments we can put on the seed to attract moisture, so moisture attractants. Um, we're also looking at um, uh, different hormones that we might put on the seed uh, to get an impact on early growth and establishment. So Rob, if a product shows potential out of your program, what happens, what's the next steps in that? evaluation. So if something shows potential in the discovery phase we then move it uh, upstream and we look at uh, testing that compound or that treatment over a range of different environments and that would be tested from uh, hay uh, in the south right through to emerald in the north. Thanks Rob, thanks for the chat, much appreciated, very exciting things to hear about. Thanks Ken. These projects are finished, the trial report's written and they're uploaded onto the website and uh, along with a lot of other resource material that can be of assistance to growers, it's available there for download. Uh, so I encourage you all to, to visit the site and um, make the most of the resources there.